just got back from the farm. I thought I'd take a video in the process of doing things. This is my milk. I got a half gallon of goat milk and drank some. And the rest is here. And then this is all cow's milk. And let's see. I'm gonna have this coconut this morning, uh, maybe at lunchtime with my daughter. These are the empty bottles that I'm cleaning up. And I'm making my rye kishk for the second time. This stuff's awesome. I just got rave reviews from a friend who had the other, we shared the other tray. This one's gonna go till the end of the day. Watch my video on that. I got farm eggs. Might have a couple of those. Wow, look at that one. And I'm making more pineapple. That's my second batch with the same pineapples. And this is fermented red onion with whey and water in there. Got some potatoes. And in the fridge from the farm, I got a small turkey for the family on turkey day. And I got deer. And back there is still some old lamb organs, some high meat, some sour cream cheese. I got old seven year um, cheese, some burger meat that I was making for my daughter, some onions. I've been eating a little bit of onion. This is an uh, old quart of milk. I'm going to get that one out. Let that warm up. I have fat from lamb fat. Brought it up here from the downstairs fridge. I have a deer heart. Some more old lamb there in containers. And uh, these are lamb rib parts. I'm still gonna eat. I still have this lamb bread. I think I'm gonna get that out and eat that later today. And I got some pickles at the farm. This is garlic and onion homemade Amish pickles. And I have some pickles I bought from the grocery store early. I have my whey here, whole thing away. Mustards. This is my starter for my rye, which I have not used because I've been making it with milk that's been sitting out for a week. This is tallow. I have beef tallow here and sheep tallow. So let's see, in the bottom I have butter and organic, I mean, uh, yeah, organic coconut cream raw. And that's the tour. There's the milk stored away. And I also wanted to point out that I got beet kvass, so fermented beet juice. And I'm going to be drinking that. It's nice and red, like blood. All right, grocery store trip. Got some awesome. Honeycrisp apples. Well, they look awesome. Green apples. I got a watermelon, organic. Banana. Still Italian mineral water. I got a couple of those. And I got a bunch of these Gerolsteiners. Got organic grapefruit, three of those. One organic pear, looks awesome. Parsley, carrot celery, and cucumber, English. I'm gonna juice these tomorrow morning. And some flowers. Also, my friend came by and brought me beets from his organic garden. And I'm gonna make those for the Thanksgiving Day dinner. Also, I got these two kinds of rice. Organic Jade Pearl and Organic 
forbidden rice. Ooh, it's black. Looks good. Hi, this is what I ate in a week for Sunday, November 22nd. I've been having a lot of rye this week. Homemade rye kish is my favorite. I've also been eating some store-bought rye. A lot of apples, oranges, citrus. I had coconut, coconut cream. I also had a whole coconut with the water and the meat and everything mixed with pineapple. Been having a lot of pineapple. A lot of things for the gallbladder. And a lot of other fruit. And a lot of honey, a lot of Manuka honey. I finished a small jar of Manuka honey and bought another one. I also ate some regular, um, what did they call that? Really raw honey that I get from my farm. And let's see, I've been having lamb ribs that are three or four weeks old. They're really good and had some old lamb organs that were like high meat and some sauerkraut pickles and I had some watermelon today and let's see this morning I had a lot of deer I had a deer heart a friend brought me a deer from a, a hunting up in the mountains of Pennsylvania so it's totally wild fresh awesome deer I got the uh, heart uh, I think you'll see that in another video so I won't get into that but I've been eating that also look for my video called how to open a coconut that's coming out soon um, so yeah I've been continuing with uh, the high amount of fruit and the high amount of rye. I've been having some potatoes also, steamed potatoes, and more egg yolks only. I cut out the whites a couple weeks back and that's been doing really well. Feels better on my gallbladder and better overall. I eat more of the yolks than I ate of the whole eggs because they're not bothering me at all and I'm feeling really good. My gallbladder is totally calming down. I still feel some pressure in there, but it's way better than it was, and I'm feeling really good about it. So I think that's everything for this week. I hope you're having a great day, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.